Welcome back. You're watching Daybreak. Many thanks indeed for staying tuned. My name is Wahiga Mwaura. Now this morning we want to talk about hydro modification versus excavation. And that's a topic that's been trending since Sunday, ever since the governor of Kiambu County weighed in on this matter, Ferdinand Waititu, who joins us now in studio. Yeah. Welcome to the program, yeah. Governor. Thank you, so much. Thank you for finding time to be here with us yeah. today. And for any of our viewers who might not have caught what he said, let's play that clip for you and then I'll engage the Governor further moving forward. Naona pale kama hiyo watu wana support ya ubomoaji mimi hapana support Mambo iangaliwe kama kuna nyumba yako inakaribiana na muto wewe uambiwe ni gharama yako kuhakikisha hiyo mtu imesonga kidogo Lakini kubomoa nyumba is not a solution honestly speaking it's such a big loss Na tena mjue Nairobi beleni Governor you looked incensed in that video you looked a bit angry. Do you regret making no, no, no. those statements no, two no, days no, no. later? No, honestly speaking, uh, having been a resident of Nairobi and having been uh, a leader here in Nairobi, uh, there is a time that there was also some uh, an attempt to, to demolish houses here in Nairobi when I was a member of parliament in Nambakasi. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I honestly stopped that and uh, with a reason which let alone people realize it was a good reason because I was just requesting like I'm doing now that uh, we form that the people who are planning the demolitions should form a big committee mm -hmm. that will include the, the, the property owners okay. and the experts from the property owners side. Okay. So, Let's so say like engineers uh, and who, who will speak on behalf of the, of, of the, of the property owners so, so that before any demolition is done, mm -hmm. there's a, a lot of consultation that will have been, would ha, will have gone on, and uh, people will have considered all the options, such that when they, 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 they take the decision of demolishing, it's a, it's it's the, last be, it is the last resort. So let me ask you, were you speaking in that video as the governor of Kiambu County? Were you speaking as a private landowner in Nairobi? Who were you speaking as? Uh, first and foremost, I'm the chairman of... Uh, urban development and planning and housing in the case of governors. So you are speaking from that uh, Yes, role. I'm a chairman of the, the, of the same... No, uh, I'm asking, so were you speaking uh, yes, as yes, in yes. that capacity? In that capacity, Not yes. as a landowner in Nairobi? Uh, no, 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 not as a landowner, but as, a, as, a, as somebody who is in the, the position of, uh, of, uh, of uh, planning, as, I, as I'm telling you, and uh, also uh, housing and uh, urban development. Okay. And the Council of Governors. And Council of Governors. Yes. And again, I repeat this, not as a landowner in Nairobi. You know, yeah, although I am one of them. You I are mean, one of them. I'm one of the landowners in Nairobi. I can't, I can't cheat, yes. At least I have properties here. Do you have land on riparian? No, no. Not on riparian. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So yes, for you, this I have pieces of land that are touching on the, li the, the river, but I have not built any houses. Any house. Oh, so you have pieces of land that are touching yes, on the river? Yeah. Some, in some place. Okay, in some place. Yes. So how do you plan to then develop with what you know now? Do you still feel that you would want to develop close to the river with, with everything that you know no, here? No, no, but, but you know, in, in future now, from now henceforth, I think people will, will all, or definitely not build near the river. But uh, considering that some of the ones who are built, built a long time ago, honestly. And uh, you know the law do not uh, act retrogressively. It doesn't move backwards. It, 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 it can. I don't know, but it doesn't. It, you, if you, you, you have to consider that what happened later on, uh, before, uh, is something that happened b because of some other reasons. Because like now, honestly, we need to blame the, 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 the people who approved those uh, uh, building plants, mm -hmm. the NEMA itself, because they were supposed to have stopped that construction when, on, when, it, when it started. But uh, we, we, we must treat the developers themselves, the owners of the, those properties, as victims, first and foremost. Mm -hmm. Because nobody could have put, put in a lot of money like the, the one we have seen in some of the buildings without knowing very well that he's making a mistake. Because so, so, honestly, you are he, so are you here today speaking sort of on behalf of those victims? No, no. I, I, I honestly, you have heard yourself also that they, are, they, they, they want to demolish 4,000 of them. Mm -hmm. You can imagine 4,000 4, houses, how many people, people are supposed to suffer. Obviously, a single house might have about uh, 100 beneficiaries. 
So the, 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 the people who might suffer in this whole operation might be more than 30,000 people. Fair, fair enough, uh, Governor. And uh, some of them yes. are going to suffer downstream. Okay. So, so that, and that's an interesting point that you raise. My question to you then is, you've come out very strongly, especially on this issue of yeah. property on riparian land. Yes. Where was your voice when an almost estimated 30,000 people were going to be removed from a section of Kibera? Weren't those also Kenyans no, no. who are affected because of what Kura wanted to do in terms of building a road? Where no, was no, your no. voice then? No, no, no. I, that one I was not... Uh, I, I, person, I, I think I could have supported such an operation. What? Because, because uh, that was road that was supposed to be constructed, okay. which is going to, to, to help even that same area. Because honestly... Uh, but if people you, are if going to be affected, uh, No, no, no. If you look at the, the, what is happening in Kibira, they are developing the place by putting up a story building and they're also putting in uh, the same people who are there so that they can benefit now with the new housing. Personally, I support that. So you support development where you put infrastructure, but you don't support reclaiming the environment? Uh, no, not reclaiming the environment. Because that's what uh, Neymar uh, trying to just, do. Just imagine, uh, like, uh, for example, in uh, Holland, uh, in the Netherlands. Do you know that uh, most of the, 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 the places there is uh, reclaimed land? People live, but the water is directed, is channeled, is, is canaled, canalized. Yes. You, you make canals. That it is possible. Even here, honestly, you, you just be, you are supposed to build an embankment wall so that you, you put a canal sort of, so that the river can follow the canal. Mm -hmm. But you don't need to go to that, big, to that extent of demolishing. Because 4,000 people affecting 30,000 uh, residents who, 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 are, who are just innocent Kenyans, honestly speaking, and there is an alternative. According to me, that one is... So there was no alternative a, for the 30,000 in Kibera? No, that, was, that is a road. That what's, fact, what, what's the difference? The is difference what I'm trying is to understand. that that same road is supposed to, 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 to serve them. But Nobody this one, stopped these people when they were constructing on but, that place, uh, no, which is the same case for the rivers. And you've uh, said, we didn't know, you know when people were building on Repen. What's yes. the difference? I thought you'd be defending those in Kibera in the no, same no, no, measure no, no, no. You see, as you're defending you, this group you, now. But, but honestly... Uh, the river has been there, the, the, the building is, has also been there, isn't it? And the, 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 there is no problem, they, they can coexist, only that you, you can push it, the river course a bit. And according to me, honestly, that is not something that has not happened before. Look at uh, the city of Bombay. Mm -hmm. the, city, the new city of Bombay has been reclaimed from the sea. 2,000 acres have been reclaimed from the sea. And that is the new way. So uh, buildings and water is not a big deal when they, 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 are, they are near each other. So according to me, we, we must be realistic. And we, we must be realistic and practical and also mind about the welfare of others. Like, because 4,000 Kenyans, mm -hmm. innocent Kenyans, who are just a victim of corrupt officers, honestly, they should not suffer. Fair, uh, fair, fair uh, enough. What we like should have taken, the step we should have taken mm -hmm. first is first form a committee. Mm -hmm. A committee that will involve the the, 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 the the property owners first and foremost. Some of our uh, uh, some of our even engineers, uh, some, some representing uh, our business community, because in these houses there are so many business people there who are earning their living from there. And let me tell you, some of these buildings have been built through loans. Some have been built through pension fund. Mm -hmm. uh, so, so 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 many people honestly when they are. Places are demolished. Some of them will end up in the grave. Okay, I want, to, I want to explore the option yes. you've brought up. And you've said we need to be realistic. So le yes. let's be realistic. Yes. When will it be practical to canalize, as you have said? Mm. When will it be practical de to demolish? Because yeah. if we're talking about 4,000 properties that are on riparian land, mm. are you saying that we should move the river at least no, no, 4,000 no, no, times? No, no, what, no, what I'm saying, mm -hmm. if we canalize, it, the river will just follow the car. The, 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 we'll, the, we'll don't we'll don't, don't forget. Uh -huh. they, no, the property owners. In fact, that is what was, uh, we were saying. The property owners should be made to, to, to meet the cost of the canalizing, building the wall to that the, the river will fall. And this is not something you just go to even Europe. You see that the river is in the town following a canal system uh, people have built embankment wall to where the river is following it is not something and new. you're trying to imagine this river is how how wide because i'm trying to imagine a situation where you will need more land to, 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 you know, to sort of divert that river you see if there are many people talking uh, consulting in some places they can even go deep, uh, deepen 
the, the river itself. This, these are options. These are options. But what I'm saying is that demolishing should be the last result. Okay, and you're, you're coming out quite, quite. Have you considered the environmental impact of your proposal? There are uh, there that, are animals. Is, there that, are that, that, that is why I'm different saying, parts of nature uh, that rely on that river that, that, that you that, are saying that, now that, we should that divert. That is why I'm saying there should be a committee to consult. And again, also what I'm also trying to emphasize very sincerely, mm -hmm. and I'm an honest person. Uh, and I don't believe the first period now is to clean it. Because most of the, 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 the stuff in the river is sewerage, mm -hmm. is a sewer system. Mm -hmm. So we need to clean the river first and foremost, so that we are left with the pure water. Because even some of the streams now, some of the river is not actually river, it is seasonal streams. And according to me, uh, the option of demolishing somebody who has a property or somebody who has a loan of 200 or 300 million loan, some people have invested with their with their with their with their pension. Some people, and that is where the family is okay. living. Okay, and, and I, think, so I, I think it's so painful it, that that yeah. it is something that should be considered and that uh, with the, uh, and the, the with property with owners, okay. the sobriety, and okay. the, the owners will be convinced that now this one. Even if it is demolished, there, there was nothing else that could have been done. Obviously, your yes. comment has, your, your, your statement that happened on Sunday has raised quite some reactions. Let me read you some of the reactions. Mm. Honorable Gunjiri Wambogo, yes. on this table yesterday, MP Nyeri said, mm. it is kind of suspicious to hear Waitito speak about this matter so passionately. We remember the kind of drama we used to have when he was the Embakasi MP. Is he worried about buildings that he knows exists in the wrong places? Is that your concern? But no, no, that no, you no. know there are certain structures, maybe in your name, in the name of friends, uh, no, no, that no, no, could no. be caught up in this crackdown? No, 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 not that I, not, not any that I know, but I know there are buildings, obviously, that will be caught up in this operation. And uh, you have heard, obviously, that there are 4,000. Any that you own? No, no, not that I own. Or that you're in a company that no, that no, company no, no, owns? No, 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 not that no. I own. This is not personal. Okay. Yes. Okay, don't it's forget. not personal. This one is not personal. Don't forget I've been a leader in this city. In the level of uh, 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 an MP and also an, uh, an assistant minister, and you don't forget that I almost became the governor of Nairobi. So at least I don't. don't I'm somebody who understands the issues in this city. Mm -hmm. Yes, not even this city, but somebody who who, who is concerned about the welfare of others. Okay. Yes, I cannot just sit back and see and watch. As, as, as a leader, I just watch people's property being Which is why I asked you about whether, whether you weighed in on the Kibera issue, but you said <laughs> that one you, you supported. No, no, no. no, no. Uh, that is a road that will also, in, in a way, we will also help them. Because if, how, the, how will if, it? if the area that has now uh, uh, will be upgraded, for example, like parts of Kibera on the, on the, on the, right in the Saba side, yes. because I understand that area so much. On the right suburb side, if you go there, you see that there are some areas that have been upgraded. They have story building that has but taken up. Now, if that area is also upgraded and there is a road, honestly, they will benefit. So but, but, me, but I also know that for the last couple of weeks, yeah. an estimated 30,000 people have not had somewhere to sleep. I mean, we did stories about the way their lives have changed the, the, because yeah. of the demolitions. And yeah. you say... You care about the human cost of yeah, these yeah. demolitions, but on that one, Honestly, you support I, I, it. I sympathize with their case, but I know eventually they, they, might, they might also benefit from the upgrading. Some would say that <laughs> the ones you are now supporting on riparian land will also benefit from the demolishing, the mm -hmm. mo demolishing of their mm -hmm. property because the environment will thrive. Uh, no, no, Our no, rivers no, will uh, flow uh, free uh, once again. Uh, uh, don't forget, honestly, that uh, uh, the levers in Nairobi uh, some of them are seasonal. They are not. They are not continuous. Mm. They, 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 they are just seasonal rivers, seasonal streams, and uh, these are people who are already there for a long time, and they are there by right, because when they bought those plots, they bought them legally through through the right of channel. And you're talking. This is before the acts came in. Yeah, there. yeah, exactly, Act, exactly, the yeah, yeah, exactly. So let, let's so, so, uh -huh. let's discuss scenarios. Yeah. If per chance in the future we find out that Governor Waititu owns property on riparian land, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. what option will you have? Do you will you divert the river there? Uh, no, 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 no. I, 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 no, I, I, I am saying I, I can, and I repeat it to your face that I, I don't have any uh, any property on riparian land. 
and this uh, what I'm speaking I'm speaking not from for, because it's not personal to me I'm just speaking as a, as a, as a honest Kenyan and somebody who understands the issues in Nairobi and who understands again that if there is a mistake first you deal with the person who made that mistake mm -hmm. the person who did the mistake is the people who approved these these uh, these uh, uh, these uh, designs and who, who who could have taken action who, because the developers could have could not have developed if they knew there is a problem these are just victims they are victims why don't we deal with the with, the, with the, those people who are supposed to to stop the development okay first and foremost the, the, while while nobody can take away the fact that there are some who may be victims there mm. are some who we know and cases have been in court that yeah. colluded Yes. with corrupt government officials. Yes. If you carry on with your campaign, yes. are you not afraid of also shielding the corrupt? No, no, no. I, my thinking is... Because you're almost saying everybody my, who's... My thinking is that uh, first and foremost, before somebody is condemned, they must be heard, first and foremost. And that is why I'm talking of a committee that will look at that, every... That will look at every problem and uh, on its own merit so that at least the developer himself can be heard before anything is done so that and and the documents can be looked into okay so at least the, 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 at least the whole issue will be understood and the developer himself will be heard the most important thing here is have the developer himself been heard and has issues have all issues been considered or options because i believe strongly that if you can move or you can, if you can make a, a a, a, a kind of sort of and, uh, and uh, the, the, the developer can take care of the embankment wall mm -hmm. and the the, 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 the the problem is over why why would you think that that build uh, bring down the building is, is have is, you have you taken this have you taken your new campaign to president Uru Kenyatta no 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 okay no. you've you heard what he has said he yeah, has said yeah, all buildings know, on know, my, land my should message be is down. not to the president but to those who started this whole issue and uh, because, uh, b b do you going, think the president is behind this no, I don't think interagency? So. No, no, I don't think so. So they're working alone? Uh, yeah, without, yeah, yeah. Without I don't think that, that, uh, that is what I believe. That okay. Is, yes. Even though the president has stood you know, in public and said that uh, anyone who approved land on uh, uh, Riparian... My, my, message, sort of uh, my message is those who are, who are doing it, who started it, that they could have considered the representation of the, of the property owners. Mm -hmm in the committee and that committee could have been very very transparent so that everybody can be heard everybody can, all options could have been considered in that 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 uh, whole process and my strongest belief is and that is what we did last time when there was the same attempt of demolishing houses okay and i was there and i suggested the same that we include the the, the, the representative from the land owners yes when it happened in fact, they went to so many buildings and found out that the mistakes in the building can be, can be made and uh, you don't need to demolish the building. Okay. There are some things that you can, the, the house can live so, with. So again, you so see no contradiction with what you are saying and what the president is, no, is no, preaching No, 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 I don't see. In fact, I'm his supporter myself. I support his position so much. But honestly, if, so, you, are, okay. if you are my friend, <laughs> Wehiga, I like the if, part, you, the part. If, <laughs> if you are my friend, you are, if you are a good friend, honest friend you must always tell me the truth so are you telling the president the truth that, no 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 that no, this no, is no, being no, out in the no, no, no you must always speak the truth even so, and that is my position i have always got i i, I stand by my position that that that, that that is the truth and that is the feeling of people out there let me tell you you know people don't you the people just speak and uh, without considering that there are others there are so many of them mm -hmm. who are considering what what you are talking about my position is supported by so many people who, who because people feel that it has started upstream but it's soon going to downstream eastlands is lee and uh, everywhere and their down properties there. might be affected uh, and well, let's, uh, yeah. let's talk scenarios again mm. when a river follows the path that nature set out mm. it's rare for it to flood mm. unless there's like sort of intense mm. rain like the kind we see in Tana mm. river mm. when rivers are blocked because of structures and mm. we saw this in nairobi mm. earlier this year mm. then it really floods mm. there is a concern that if we follow the path that you're saying we divert a river mm. away from its natural course mm. that it could flood again 
And when flooding happens, mm. people lose their lives, property is destroyed. Are you willing to, in a sense, take up that risk that should what Waitito is proposing no, work no, I, 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 and then things like that happen? It I, could I, be I wanted you. to give you an example. Just uh, near the, the university roundabout, where there's a... University of Nairobi. Yeah, 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 yeah near the museum. Just look at that roundabout on the left. From town, when you want to go to, let's say, like like on the museum side. Okay. There is a small, there is a, the, it was not like that. The river was diverted a bit so that that garden can be made. The river was diverted. Just look at it properly. And, it, and, and if you go, if, and in fact, you have even seen when people, when people are constructing a bridge, they make a, a, an embankment wall that is a the box carved so that the river can pass. And, and, and so, so making an embankment wall so that the water can be dilected, mm -hmm. can be canalized to follow the direction. That is not something, that is not a lot to ask. Instead of demolishing somebody, a whole 300 billion going down to the drain, <laughs> and the, the person himself was, is a victim. There are some people is who this, Is this your solution for all the 4,000 structures that NEMA or the interagency team are eyeing? No, no, no. My, my, my stand is uh, if we have a committee where we shall involve the property owners, mm -hmm. uh, they, they, they will consider all options. And the demolishing will be the last resort. Will be the last resort. Uh, yeah, if nothing else can be done. So, and the others maybe that will go down, but that will be the last option. That is why I I I, I just requested that uh, a committee be formed, where all all all, all stakeholders will be will be incorporated, and all options will be considered, including canalizing the river, so that it can follow the direction that, that will not harm our own people so much. Okay. Because I strongly feel that uh, all of us, don't forget, we are all stakeholders in this country. And uh, if anything is affecting you or me negatively, eh, I should be heard. Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, Let me. I yes. want to get some some final feedback here. We did have some SMSs. I hope we'll be able uh, to put that up mm -hmm. in just a few. Mm -hmm. um, somebody here says. Shiro says. Uh, I'm a bit concerned. The governor seems to support demolitions in Kibra, where he has no land, but he does not. He does not defend demolitions at riparian land, where where he thinks he has land. They're a bit concerned about that. They see a contradiction. No, How no, do you no, respond no, to, to me? To me, unless Wanjiro's? unless uh, Wanjiro has misunderstood me. I said, Kibera, they, they were making a road. A road is beneficial to everybody. It's a service coming. At what cost? Uh, 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 no, it, this is a service that is coming. This is a service. A road is very important. Maybe in the future, the houses that have been, uh, uh, that the, the fires we have been seeing there, maybe the, that the same road now will be used to, to for, by the fire brigades. So it will help the area, honestly. Okay. Opening a road at any place is good. But allowing a river to uh, flow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And again, but if I, because I understand Kibera may be better even than her, there, there is a program for upgrading. And if the same processes are upgraded, the people who suffered on the, when the, the demolitions were done mm -hmm. might be considered now in the upgrading and they benefit from the new housing. So according to me, there, 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 are, there, are, there are options there. In the Kibera so, so when, so and, and, and let me take this as my last question. Yeah. So when you've seen the reaction to your statement, I'm sure yeah. your t digital team have told you about the tweets and, yeah. and what leaders are saying. Yes. You feel that you've been misunderstood? I, 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 no, no. I, 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 I tend to think that uh, some of those people do not understand the different scenarios. Okay. Yes, yes. Maybe some of them have not traveled like I have. And the scene, the, the canal, uh, how rivers are canalized, and uh, how, how, like the way I've just told you about Bombay City, where, where, where the at whole 2000 land was reclaimed from the sea, and okay. uh, that's where the, uh, you, go, you even go to a place like Dubai, the Palm City, it is on reclaimed land. And yes. Isn't it? You go to, ho to Netherlands, you see that uh, the, the, the whole, uh, the, the, uh, most, most parts of the, whole, uh, the Netherlands were reclaimed from the sea and they, and they have canalized to some yes. so, and, and again, it yes. has nothing to do with any interests you may have. Yes, and this, my stand has not, uh, there's no interest whatsoever, personal interest. It's just that uh, I'm concerned about the right of more than 10,000 or so so Nairobi residents who, who are innocent, who might be victims of, of, uh, 
of corrupt uh, uh, government employees. Fair enough. Uh, Fair who enough. have not even been prosecuted so far. Okay, okay. Yes. Well, and, and, and one last comment. I, I get a brief one from you. Somebody here is asking, uh, let me see their name. Um, someone called Shikanda. No, no, not, not that one. A different one. Um, Mwangi Maina mm -hmm. is asking, is Waitito governor of Kiambu or of Nairobi? No, no, I, I said I'm a chairman. My, my chairmanship is national. Okay. Yes. Okay. It, it's just, national. Just a, no, it was a response for the, for the person who was asking. <laughs> but my chairman, maybe he never had I'm the chairman of the. I was asking Alba, you so that they, Alba, Mwangi can. Alba get. Development and Planning and Housing. I'm okay. the chairman. Okay. Uh, and it's Fair enough. Mwangi, position. There's, yeah. there's your response. Um, yeah. I did have a few more questions, but unfortunately, our, our yes. time is up. Mm. Governor, thank you so much for thank finding you. time. Thank you so much. To be here with us this morning, <laughs> even so as you carry on with your message, which uh, has been received by different quarters. Uh, uh, in different ways. All right, I need to hand you over now.